his cell now. This exclusive NBC4 video shows two deputies working in the jail late Monday morning. They were preparing for video arraignments for municipal court when a fight broke out between escapee David Payne and another inmate. Deputy Shannon Plumley, who had been on the job less than a year, entered the booking room with another deputy to break up that fight. During the breaking up of the altercation, we believe that's when the handcuff key was dropped in the booking area, and you see the other inmate bend over and uh, come back up off the floor with something. Fayette County Sheriff Vernon Stanford tells me that altercation happened just before noon, but it would be several hours later after Payne escaped custody before the handcuff key was reported missing by the jail administrator. She knew the key was missing. She still allowed an inmate to be released to go to be released from the confines, even though he was shackled. She knew the key was missing and didn't she didn't account for that and she didn't let anybody know that she couldn't account for it. Stanforth says had Jeopardy Plumley reported the missing key earlier, the jail would have been put on lockdown and every inmate searched. Instead, investigators say Payne used the key to free himself from cuffs and shackles like these while being transported to Fayette County Memorial Hospital for treatment. When the transport van door opened, Payne overpowered the lone deputy and took off. NBC4 wanted to know why two deputies were not assigned to the transport van. Sheriff Stanforth tells me his office assigns transport deputies according to the number of inmates and that the veteran deputy who drove the van has made similar runs over his 50-year career. If we would have had multiple inmates, high-risk inmates, it would have been two deputies. He could have easily been classified as a high in, as a high risk because of other incidents in his past. We weren't necessarily aware of those at the time, but, but he, he didn't present any problems in our facility from Friday till, to Monday.